intercepts Rip Richard Pryor. gathered here today to make sure everyone eats. If not each other, food. I was gonna talk about something now, that's very serious and I hope no one gets offended. I wanna talk about fucking. And sometimes I talk about it and a lot of people in the audience don't know what I mean. So would you raise your hand if you don't know what fucking is <laughs> so we can watch your ass when you leave here. <laughs> There's not enough fucking going on in America. Americans, Reagan, get in, you stop fucking. We fucked when Carter was in, we fucked all the time. Just had, there was nothing else to do. Hey, let's fuck. President making a speech, let's fuck. Reagan in, now everybody listen to this mother. We can't fuck now. I say get them last few fucks in now. <laughs> One of the advantages, like when you're in show business, the little extra treat you get is that you get pussy. And no, you know, the, the great pussy drought of the 50s? I was caught up in that motherfucker. I'm talking about. <laughs> I discovered masturbating by accident. I'm not lying, I was about 10, I was in the tub. In, and that's when you used to have to hold your dick with two fingers. I mean, you remember when you was little like that? You... Right, I was in the tub then. I said, hey. I'm on to something here. I bet dad don't know about this. And then, then when you was young, remember men, right? We didn't come or nothing. You just made that funny feeling. You know, yeah, who are you? <laughs> First time I came, ejaculated, scared the fuck out of me, man. I thought something was wrong, right? I was with this woman and said, look at the fuck you done did. <laughs> About an hour later, though, I was back to my, can you do it again? <laughs> Women are so cool about sex. They like it as much as we do, but they can be cooler. What do you say, you wanna fuck? No. <laughs> and they go home and have all that electrical equipment. <laughs> so, I can't get off behind that long shit and mm, nothing. I remember one time I got some Playboy bunny pussy. I thought I was in the big time. Going home with a Playboy bunny. You dig? We was gonna have a nice little midnight snack. I went to her apartment and was one her apartment was bad. It was one of them apartments that said, if I don't get the pussy, I can fuck this couch. <laughs> and she, we started talking and she had seen my act. She said, oh, I really like the way you do those little kids in your act. And it was great. Can you talk like a little kid? 
He said, what, now? Yeah, just do a little. I feel funny, I mean, like, okay, I just, like, you mean like when I do this, like that? She said, yeah. I said, you like that, huh? And she started taking off clothes. And the more clothes she took off, the younger I got. When she got to her panties, I was on the floor talking about, mama, mama. She gave birth to me about 9.30. Can I get some water? There was supposed to be a stool and some water or something. Is it April Fool? Oh, this is the one. Well, I have to walk way the fuck over there and get some. Water. Thank you, brother. Don't trip. You're nervous than me. Shit. Thank you. I wish I'd had a picture of that shit. <laughs> Thank you. Mm. Huh? Water. As far as I know. I hope I don't start tripping. Did that, was that here all the time? Huh? That motherfucker been there all the time? Wait a minute, we don't know nothing but the drum and photographic memory. This motherfucker was not here. See, we may not be literate, but we visual in the motherfucker. Just need a little water to relax, calm down. Because I, I feel the tension from y'all. Y'all want me to do so well. I want to do so well for you. But let's relax and enjoy whatever the fuck happens. I got my check. I'm telling you something. I got so fucking nervous. Myself today, I forgot what the fuck I did. I was at home, I said, I know I do something. Because there's too many white folks paying attention to me. For me not to be in jail and shit. I used to think when I first started, I said, well, maybe I ain't funny no more, you know, like maybe I ain't angry at nothing, for real, in my heart. You know, I just say, I'm just not mad about it. I don't get it. Motherfuckers want to kill yourselves, that's your business. Just don't do it on my porch. <laughs> and it really takes a lot to get up to start working, like, again, on stage, because then your mind ain't there, and your spirit, and you're trying to go for it, and greed is a bitch. Greed, say, go ahead, do it. They offer you so much money, 